Hello, Nomads Cult, and this video is just for fun. Uh, let's play a little bit with the face groups and the quadri measure. Okay, so yeah, how to create such a thing here? Okay, so I start with a new scene and I delete the sphere and we need a cylinder. So I turn the wireframe on and adjust the size a little bit. Here in the top menu we can activate the hole for the cylinder and so maybe the radius a little bit like this and so. And here for the three dots um, here you can change a little bit the topology. So, yeah. So I like it more like this here. Okay. So now we can validate this object. And you see here the face groups. The inside is a different face group than the outside and the top is different to the bottom. So we have to change this. So here you see auto picking function is active at the moment. So turn this off and now tap and hold with your finger on the face group you want. So I choose the outside face group and tap with the finger on the inside so that the face group changes. So, and I want the orange one on the top one. So, we need ring um, rings um, for yeah for the correct topology. So, remove unused. So, I add a new face group. And now here the dot mode is active. And here in the brush filter settings, you can set here a keep sharp angle. So it's easier to, to use the face group brush here on, yeah, on the surface surface of the object. So, okay. So I brush now with a small radius the inner ring. Like this. And we need um, a ring outside. So, and like this. So, we need the face groups also on the bottom. So, I use now the symmetry, change to the Y plane, and I mirror it from top to the bottom. Okay, so I Yeah, I think I use the Y. Okay, now our face groups are perfect. So, very nice. So now we need a clone of this ring. I clone it and I use a gizmo to bring it in position. So at the moment we, we didn't see our face groups. So here in the shading menu, there's an option to activate the face group view. So now I try to align the face groups. And here on the left side there's a snapping option for 90 degrees. So I rotate the whole thing like this and I try to align my face groups. Something like this here. And here this area we have to yeah here's a break here's yeah 
the blue tone and here's the green tone. So we have to change this back to face group. And now I use the auto picking. So and I pick now this color. So you see here, now it's nice. And the same for the other side. So I select the other ring. sure that, that we get everything yeah it should work I hope okay here in the um, hierarchy select both meshes and boolean now the mesh is connected and here um, in the tools, I think you know the round all brush. You need this to to smooth here the the face group borders. So round all brush and brush. Yeah, one two times here on the mesh. Maybe also three times. You see here, you get the more you brush, uh, the more you get as a, such a chamfer here. So you can also use more intensity. Uh, then it looks like this. And this smoothing option here, or this round all brush, is important to um, to get nice transitions here. And you need the round all brush to do this on the whole mesh. Okay, so now let's use a quadri measure. Sorry for Android users. Um, yeah, this is only iOS. So here you see the mesh has at the moment 3600 vertices. So I try it maybe with 1000. Um, so I press re remesh and let's see what we get. So before and after. So here is a setting um, for the relax option here. Face group is active and relaxing is on. So I turn this off and I also uh, deselect the auto detect hard edges. So density painting we also not need. So let's try it again, remesh. So this is a nice topology. So. I'm happy with it. So and with this you can yeah, go further. So now it's possible to um, use the mask here for the face group. So when you tap here on the ring and extract the ring with a shell thickness um, and here smoothness we don't need. So um, you can play a little bit with it. So I think we we have too much masked. So yeah, this is why because why we have only um, yeah one uh, no division here. So yeah, that's not not easy so let's let's try it hide so let's see what happens clear all sorry i have to try it and now mask only this one and only 
take this in positive direction. Division 1, 0. So let's see the whole thing. Yeah. So you can create such nice effects. So I use again the masking um, face group in this one. So I use solo view. Okay, yeah, that's it. Um, that's just for fun. Um, a little bit playing with the face groups and the quadri measure, but it looks nice. So have fun with sculpting. Ciao.